Overcoming Fears. Hi, I'm Leanne. Hi, I'm Donna. Hi, and I'm Miriam. Have you ever been scared in your life? How does that feel? Do you feel your heart racing and that you're all alone? What thoughts come to you when you're scared? Does a part of your brain tell you that you can't do something? Did you ever try to identify why that particular situation or object is causing you to feel fear? How do you react to all of this? A man of science who may had a fear of failure once said, we cannot solve problems with the same thinking we used when we created them, Albert Einstein. Opportunities, a new student in a new school. Let's examine the situation. This, this can be a daunting experience. If, this, if that student lets her fear stop her from participating and making new experiences, then she may lose potential to make new friends and learn and be successful. Remember the last example we explained about the girl? They would get less opportunities cause of lack of gaining knowledge and lack of confidence. Here are some ways to solve this problem. One, talk to your parents to get more support or have courage to face your fear by yourself. Let me tell you a quote by Malala, a teenager who is changing the world by empowering girls' education. We were scared, but our fear was not as strong as our courage. What, what are, are your fears? fears? My fear is the game sea bag in the amazing Yas Water World. The way I overcame my fear was I trusted my friends and my family, and now sea bag is my favorite game. I used to have a crippling fear of spiders. What did I do about that? I created a spider fan club where I could get used to knowing spiders better. Now I would call spiders my friends. I had a fear of getting up on stage and performing. I overcame it by thinking that it's not uh, by... I had a fear of getting up on stage and performing, but then I thought that I used to... I, uh, it's actually easier than I imagined. And then I started to realize I just needed confidence in me. And it doesn't really matter what your biggest fear is. What matters is to make a conscious decision to conquer your fear. When you are scared, you always have two choices. Continue to be scared and do nothing about it, or acknowledge your fear, but find a way to deal with your fear. Let me show you a clip from the movie After Earth that deals with this concept. It's not real. The only place that fear can exist is in our thoughts of the future. It is a product of our imagination, causing us to fear things that do not at present and may not ever exist. That is near insanity, Katara. Now, do not misunderstand me. Danger. It's very real, but fear is a choice. And in conclusion, nobody says it better than Nelson Mandela. I learned that courage was not the absence of fear, but the triumph over it. The brave man is not he who does not feel afraid, but he who conquers that fear. Thank, Thank you. you.